the whole world. With its 188 countries, is currently battling against an enemy, the COVID-19 pandemic. As of this date, June 2nd, 2020, there is a global confirmed cases of 6,318,000 and 40 active cases 3 million 215,528 recovered cases 2 million 725,627 deaths 376,000 885. Despite this colossal number of infections around the world, there is a dozen of countries that are not touched yet or have not reported a single case of the novel coronavirus. What are these 12 countries? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Mommy E. Let us look at these countries without coronavirus in more detail and maybe get some insight why they currently have no reported cases. Two of these countries are located in Asia and 10 are in Oceania. The first country is North Korea with a population of 25,778,816. North Korea was the first country to close its borders. As a neighbor of China, the country closed its borders on January 21st and hasn't reopened since then. Their anti-epidemic measures are intensive and strict, which require one to two months of quarantine. The officials announced new measures, including tighter controls on water tanks and reservoir, thorough disinfection of currency notes, and the disposal of waste from vessels docked in territorial waters. Number two is Turkmenistan. It's a country in Central Asia with a population of 6,031,200. It is bordered by Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan, Tajikistan, Iran, and Afghanistan. All countries were reported with coronavirus infections. Most of their land borders are closed and in early February, they canceled many flights and all flights to and from China. Number three, the Solomon Islands with a population of 686,884. The islands are located in Oceania, and it is among one of the least visited countries in the world. You can access it easily from close countries with direct flights, including Australia, Papua New Guinea, and Vanuatu. Since early February, like many Pacific Island countries, the Solomon Islands required a medical certificate to allow entry. Travelers who enter from infected countries required 14-day quarantine. 
Number four, Vanuatu, with a population of 307,145. Vanuatu has no reported cases and implemented strict policies for those coming in from overseas from February. Those traveling from infected countries were not permitted or had to undergo quarantine and anyone arriving into the country had to provide a medical certificate. Vanuatu is also located in Oceania. It is currently ranked as the fourth on the happiest countries in the world list. Number five, Samoa, also in Oceania, with a population of 198,413. Samoa has been on lockdown since the 25th of March. A state of emergency remains in place and all international travel in and out of the country has been suspended. Number six, Kiribati, also in Oceania, with a population of 119,451. There are no cases in Kiribati, but a state of public emergency has been declared. From 30th of March, schools closed for two weeks. Number seven, Federated States of Micronesia also in Oceania, with a population of 115,030. Micronesia was very quick to implement travel bans in early February, including entire travel bans for those traveling from China and Chinese citizens. Number eight, Tonga, also in Oceania, population 105,695. Tonga has been strict with travel rules since February. Since Fiji's first reported case of coronavirus, Tonga closed its borders to foreigners and only allowed foreigners to leave who were traveling back on flights to their own countries. As of 29th of March, Tonga has been in lockdown. Number nine, the Marshall Islands. In Oceania, population 59,190. On 21st of March, it was reported that the only international flight connection with the Marshall Islands ceased service temporarily for at least three weeks. Number 10, Palau in Oceania, population 18,094. Currently, there is one person under investigation for having coronavirus after having traveled from Guam. However, 
there are currently no coronavirus infections in Palau. Eleven, Tuvalu in Oceania, population 11,793. This is often known as one of, if not the least visited country in the world. Tuvalu sees fewer than 200 tourists per year. This probably has been a massive help in preventing an outbreak in this country with a very small population. Number 12, Nauru in Oceania, population 10,823. Nauru is a country so small that you can walk around it in one day. Nauru has managed to stay coronavirus free. Along with Tuvalu, it holds the record for being one of the least visited countries in the world. So those are the 12 countries that remain COVID free as of today. I urge you friends to please stay safe. Always wash your hands, wear your face mask, and always social distance. Thank you.